Hi, I'm Planetary. I'm Ashna. I'm Alicia. And I'm Naomi. And we are from Team EcoSoap. Representatives of SMK Asinta. We'd like to present to you our innovation. The key to change the world, SOFO. Your travel-friendly friend. When one thinks of pollution, generic terms like waste disposal, smoking, and littering comes to mind. However, a lesser-known factor that plays a big part in environmental pollution is, you guessed it, chemical soap. Like a wolf in a sheep's clothing, the underlying disadvantages of our regularly made soap are concealed by the lack of public awareness. These soaps are able to cause blockage in water waste due to a chemical called phosphate, which is used in most soaps and detergents. This chemical leads to the growth of freshwater algae blooms that clogs waterways and reduces the concentration of oxygen in water, simultaneously destroying our ecosystem. Aside that, the dependency of palm oil and the manufacturing of these soaps causes the depletion of oil palm population. Besides its pollutive features, the production of chemical soaps entail animal cruelty and the use of synthesized and damaging substances. As these soaps contain harmful irritant substances such as paraben and sulfate, safety can only be established through animal testing. The main role of our soap is to ultimately replace all chemical soaps. The question that remains is how exactly our soap outweighs it enough to replace it. Firstly, it is able to oppose all the disadvantages of regular soap, such as it is made of eco-friendly, replenishable material. Other than that, through the obsolescence of regular soap, we can avoid animal cruelty and preserve the biodiversity of marine life. Our soap also has its independent benefits, dominantly being that we recycle used cooking oil to make the soap. By establishing this soap, we have found an alternative use for the unused cooking oil. This inadvertently serves as a contribution to reduce water pollution, in the sense that large-scale commercial brands can now use our soap as an alternative, rather than dumping their used oil in nearby sewers. The silver lining to it is that the use of oil in our soaps helps increase the cleansing ability of the soap, in the sense that it eases its lather and provides supple, healthy skin. In the aspect of convenience, our soap is just as easy to use, if not easier. We can prove that through a demonstration. It washes off easily, lathers just fine and leaves your hand clean and immaculate. Notice its small, pellet-like shape made specifically to fit into any sized and shaped container. Here we have comically used an M&M branded container. As much as this soap is intended to benefit our health and the environment, we have chosen this innovation as a way to expose the chemistry behind soap making. Soot reaction can be seen to occur at the third step of the process, where the fats and lye can be found in the cooking oil and caustic soda respectively. The saponification generally takes about 24 to 48 hours to complete once the lye and oils have been mixed and the raw soap has been poured into the mill. One of the scientific processes used in soap making is known as saponification. Saponification literally means turning into soap from the root word sapo, which is Latin for soap. Saponification is a chemical reaction as results of the contact between fats and lye. This occurs when the triglycerides of fats and lye are combined and react to form a fatty acid metal salts, the soap and glycerin. Now, I will explain the process to make the soap. First, 30 grams of caustic soda is added to 150 grams of water. Measurements have to be specific as the amount of fats and alkaline have to be accurately proportionate. The mixture is then stirred and left still. Step three is to slowly add the mixture to the used cooking oil where saponification takes place. After the mixture is thick, essential oil is added to the soap. Lastly, the soap is left to be air-dried for about a month. We hope that through this innovation, the public will realize the importance of efforts taken to preserve and conserve the environment, however minor they may be.
It may be merely a small step in the grand plan of reducing all pollution. But together we can make it a leap. Thank you for granting us this opportunity to make a difference.